Today, we are going to talk about Richard Donnell Ross, a.k.a. Freeway Rick Ross. Freeway. So, if some of you guys don't know, he, Rick Ross, is essentially the person that is what the show is about. It's inspired by him, his life in L.A. And so, a little brief history um, on Rick Ross. He was born and raised in California. He is known for being a convicted drug trafficker, best known for his empire he established in L.A. So, like we see on the show, he's known for discovering what crack cocaine was mm -hmm. and bringing it to... Well, not discovering it, but he went to another city and figured out what this was and brought it to L.A. and like made Franklin. it what it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, Rick Ross was, like, the first person to bring... Crack Bring to it LA. to oh. LA. So that's what that's what Franklin did because he went up to Oakland. Well, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. But I mean, I know Rick Ross yeah. did that. So he actually, um, when he visited wherever he went, um, it was in 1979 when he discovered this new found drug, and he didn't believe that it was real until he started seeing like what it was doing with people, like on the show. Mm -hmm. And that's when he brought it back to um, the Bay Area and all of you know Southern California, and that's when his whole empire began. So as a kid, he was good at tennis, which led him to go to a, um, a better schooling system. Mm -hmm. But when it was time for him to go to college to receive um, a higher education, he wasn't able to get a scholarship because he was illiterate. So that's kind of what led him into this drug path that he, you know, found mm -hmm. and then built his empire. And, you know, boom. Here we are. Here we are. Here we are. And now? And now, well, now he's out of prison. So mm. fast forward to 1996, he was actually um, sentenced to life in prison um, after being convicted for purchasing 100 kilograms of cocaine from a Fed agent in a string sting operation. Oh so kind of what we see now, how we be having the Feds all in the mix too, like they they mm. cracked down and he went to prison. But his sentence was cut short and he was later released in 2009. And now he's a changed man, guys. He's an author. He goes around and he talks to the students about his life in the drug world and you know teaches them that you know there's a better there's a better route guys hey after buzzers if you like this clip be sure to check out the link in the description below to view the whole episode also we'd appreciate it if you'd like this video and comment your thoughts remember no matter what tv show you're a fan of we have an after show for you all you need to do is search after buzz tv followed by the name of your favorite tv show buzz you later